just wanted to explain that first rep for a second. Um, I took about 11 days off pulling from last week, something like that, 10 or 11. Normally I pull once a week. Um, this time, because I'm going so much heavier with bands, I decided I might take a little bit more rest. I lowered the pins again. They're in uh, pull 27 or 26, I believe. They were 27 last week. Um, before I did this, I'll even show you guys a video. I, um, I checked the, uh, the band weight to make sure I knew what it was helping. And it's helping 60 to 65 pounds at the bottom and um, obviously not at all at the top. So that's uh, a little over 840 at the bottom and about 907 at the very top or you know a little past my knees. Um, one of the things that fucked me up today was I used baby oil instead of baby powder on my uh, thighs to help prevent um, bar scraping and stuff like that, make it uh, a little bit more fluent. And I only put it on for my heavy set. So I didn't warm up with it and it threw me off a little bit because I'm not used to my, uh, my quads being so slick when I deadlift. It actually kind of slid around a little bit too much, which fucked me up somewhat. And also, if you notice in the floor there, the, uh, the mats are not the same exact height. One is ever so slightly taller than the other. So I had to position myself back a little bit further in the rack, which also threw me off. Um, combined with having my hands a little bit too close, I just kind of had a shitty first rep. Luckily, I did four more. Might have even had a fifth or, uh, excuse me, a sixth rep, and uh, we'll see what I can do next week. Thanks for watching, guys. All right, guys, obviously I just deadlifted with this, so you can say the bands are ever so slightly more stretched out. However, this is 65 pounds, and it's below this, so it's taking off less than 65 pounds at the bottom.